Hey guys, it's Deeds of the Bee here, and I'm going to be reviewing Scanners Academy Season 2. Let's get started. Make sure to check out Netflix of their website and their app for their great TV shows and movies. So, Scoundrels Academy Season 2 came out like a couple months ago. Sorry that this review took so long to release, but I'm finally doing it. But I may just do one episode. If you want me to do the others specifically, I will. There are some episodes that were completely stupid, like... Dreamcatcher getting amnesia and playing sheep ball. Um, but that's if you want me to do more reviews. I'm gonna do a review of the last episode of Scanders Academy, which I call unique. Oh, Chris Fire, if you don't like the show, I know you said the same thing with Transformers, but last night review, but that's okay. We have our own opinions. But, in my opinion, the last episode was a unique, and seeing a ridiculous version of Get Rid of the Golden Queen. Bye-bye, Queenie. Oh boy, I'm speaking chaos now. And Sparrow, after finding out about Dragon Kind, getting sent to a different realm because of Eon was shocking, and Chaos taking him, and Chaos had stabbed his mother in the back and stole her powers. I may do a video of top 10 things that are different between the show and the movies. That will probably be the next project. But Malvor looks really cool. I may do a theory video as well. Because this looks really interesting. And I won't spoil it because I want to tell you my my opinion. So Malvor's least and... Glumshanks comes as a spy, and now Malfor was released. Before that, we found out that Malfor was some, a person called the Light Eater, and took Spyro's light and turned him into Dark Spyro, and leaving us on a major cliffhanger. I hope season three turns out good, but still, other videos that I do not like. Movie, episodes that I do not like. I think this is my favorite out of all of them. But if you want me to review the other episodes, I will do it. As I said, Chris Fire, I know you said the movie was pretty bad, but we have our own opinions. And that's a part of being human. And I may explain why I like the Michael Bay series. Bye.